hypertrophia is also known as atrophy. This is where your nail slowly deteriorates, loses its shine, and falls off. This is a disorder caused by internal disease or injury to the matrix. We have developed an amazing stimulating shellless hair repair system that will keep your nail from falling off. It includes a soak, stimulating, and a no snack swag sexy stuff. <laughs> Step one is the soap. With a large basin of warm water, drop the tranquilizer nail immerse into the tub and immerse feet for five to 10 minutes. This treatment will tighten the bonds between the nail bed and plate. Antifungal uh, properties clean and disinfect the nail as well. Apply two coats of the solidifying nail reformation and allow to dry. The B vitamins will solidify the bonds within the nail strengthening the nail plate. Then apply the no snag swag socks, which will keep your nails from snagging on shoes and keep your toes from rubbing together. And that's onychotropia. Do you or anyone else have onychotrosis? If so, you might want to try a new product. It is the outgrown sock. With the outgrown sock, there are directions on the back as well. It is $25. Um, this is the product. You can see it in a lot of our stores we sell. We're the number one seller of this. So I'm going to take it out for you guys let you know a little bit about it. Okay. Right there, she's holding the sock. That's how it looks in the inside. Right here is our medication where we apply the antibiotic for your toe. You will wear it for 12, I mean, eight to 12 hours overnight. After that, you don't want to wear it that long. You want to go ahead and dispose it because if you wear it longer than that, there may be on the back as well tells you. If, um, if it, the toe is infected, you might want to go see the doctor. Don't even get the product because you don't want to waste your money. Aren't you allergic to latex? Do not put it on either. Mm -hmm. And she's gonna read a couple of things for you guys. Okay, so it's basically an ingrown toenail. It's caused by short, I mean not short, I'm sorry, tight shoes. Or if you cut or trim your toenail the improper way, you can also cause the ingrown toenail. So the symptoms are it's redness, it's tenderness, and it can cause you to limp. And if it's too bad, it can be infected. So um, basically it's just a condition on the corner of your side. The corner, Toenail on the side is just like a redness and it's a little affected and the toenail is kind of growing inwards in the corner of your toe. And then treatments that you can use, you can um, warm, soak your feet, you know, wear better shoes, or you can try socks. <laughs> and um, if it's serious, you will have to get your nail surgery removed. And then especially to go, the specialist to go see would be a dermatologist or your primary care doctor. And with that being said, when it's when you feel the tingle, it's time to mingle. It's time to mingle. <laughs> for you. Try our new FDA approved product. Bite me if you want to. It can be used on all ages. This product comes in a clear polish and a nail filer for ones that don't want to wear the polish. It leaves an unpleasant taste to prevent casual biting and sucking of the nail. It also replenishes and provides a strong and healthy shine to the nail bed. You can find this product in your local beauty supplies and drug stores. With this product, we guarantee that unacophagy will be no more. So with this product, we guarantee that a 75% nail growth will be established on your nail bed in two days. Girl, keep on, how about you? Girl, <laughs> bite me if you won't. You better use it, girl. Girl, I guess I Our product is called Citric here, it's FDA approved. It contains um, essential oils from um, oranges and lemons. Um, directions, use recommended is twice daily on affected areas and watch the white spots disappear from your nail. 
Uh, Luca Nikia, also known as white spots, occurs and uh, usually is an injury to the nail, vitamin deficiency of calcium, or from genetics. Um, Citricure is the number one solution guaranteed with fast acting results and only takes one to two days to start seeing a difference in the nail and look and color. With the money back guarantee, if you're not satisfied with the results, products starting at $21.99. And then right here, you see the white spots on the nail that I drew. And this is our product, the she can stand the product. Our slogan is you twi use twice a day and watch the white spots go away. Uh, the, the directions are to rub on your nails twice a day and rinse. And then your warning light is on the other side. Okay. Oh. And warning is to keep out of reach of like younger children and avoid eye contact because of the citrus. Mm -hmm. that has a black or brown pigmentation on finger or toenail. Uh, it can have a blackish brownish gray stripe that starts at the uh, that starts at the nail that starts and ends at the free edge. Found on a single digit, most common in minorities. Um, a few of its causes are pregnancy, trauma, friction, such as unsuitable footwear, HIV, and even too much iron. Okay. Our cure for this is Melloway. It's a lightning cream for Melonychia. You apply it each day for 20 minutes, then wipe dry. Mm -hmm. Must be used for at least three to six months for lasting results. May be used on children as well. It contains water, hydrogen peroxide, and natural herbs. It is FDA approved. Thank you. Here we go. <laughs> everyone I'm Christy I'm Elizabeth and today our word is anishoxis anishoxis is with dealing with the nail plate when the nail becomes so thick that it actually separates from the nail bed itself okay there are several possible causes for one is genetics uh, injury chronic trauma uh, can develop with age hormonal uh, disorder which is too much too much growth hormones, <coughs> psoriasis, which causes thick patches uh, underneath the nail plate, which causes it to separate from the nail bed, poor circulation, diabetes, because they normally grow thick nails anyways, <coughs> and skin disease and tight shoes. One way to treat this is removal of the entire infected nail, um, keeping your nails trimmed, and also wearing comfortable shoes. These nails can be, you can proceed with um, nail, what you want, what's the word I want to use? Services, you can polish them, you can buff them down till they shine, but normally once they're too bad, the whole nail would have to be removed. 
Okay, there are several symptoms you can look for. There's abnormal thickening of the nail, can change to yellow or a white color. The nail will start to crumble at the edges. Uh, there's possible separation of the nail plate from the nail bed. Uh, if left untreated, it can turn to a red or a black color and can develop severe pain. And that's when you would need to go to the doctor and have it removed. Uh, there's also several facts about it. It's not contagious for one. This is uh, not caused by, caused by fungus, but if you do develop this disorder, you have a higher chance of getting an infection, a fungal infection. Uh, you may continue with the surfaces as long as there's no sign of infection. Uh, the ways to handle a salon would be to file it down to a flat surface until it shines. And then ways to tame it at home, an easier way is clip straight ac across do, don't do curves because that would cause an ingrown toenail. And then wear clean con socks to absor absorb the moisture. Okay, and another home remedy that I decided to uh, treat feet with is called my soak your feet with vinaigrette. Okay? <laughs> and that is a mixture of vinegar and uh, Listerine. You use top two parts of Walk, you use two parts of vinegar to, I guess a, if you had a basin, you will fill your basin with water, put two parts of vinegar in there and maybe a cap full of Listerine. And this is supposed to help with um, fighting fungus. It helps with the smell. It helps um, the hard skin soften so that you could possibly <coughs> shave the bottom of their feet. If the nails are really thick and brittle, make the nails a little bit more pliable to work with. Um, it is an intense smell. So you wanna soak your feet in this for about 45 to 60 minutes. You don't wanna do it a lot in hot water because it will dry the skin out. You'll have more cracking. So you wanna use lukewarm water when you do this. And you can do this multiple times a week, but it can irritate you. So you need to watch how many times you do it a week. Once you notice irritation, you wanna cut back on the vinegar and the Listerine. Um, Vinegar in the store, you can get Bragg's. I recommend Bragg's with the mother liquor. I don't know why the mother liquor does something else with the fungus and all that my type microbial thingy going on up in there. Uh, it runs about $6 for the vinaigrette, about $3 for the Listerine. So it's cheap and you can do it on your own time. And once again, the name of my product is um, Vinaigrette. Soak, Soak your, your feet, feet with, with vinaigrette. <laughs>
The symptoms for this disease is a fever, sore throat, or rash. But the rashes can be found on hands, feet, or mouth. We have pictures of the hands. And the feet and the mouth um, is mostly common in. It's mostly common with children, ages 10 and younger. Um, it's a separation of the nail plate. Uh, <coughs> there is, however, a treatment for this, and it's called Xtheus. Xtheus is, um, you apply this to your feet two to three times a day, and it takes the fungus away. It kills the fungus under the nail from under, and then there you go. Do not use if you are pregnant, breastfeeding, your nails have already fallen off, you have Parkinson's disease, arthritis, osteoarthritis, or fibromyalgia. Side effects may include <coughs> burning, dizziness, skin rash, and fatigue. Oh, man. My name is Jamaica Laster, and I approve this message. <laughs> <laughs>